Hello everyone, Global Karen here, and we're going to be doing a reaction to cartoon characters I want to punch in the face by, uh, I can't pronounce the name, I'm going to call him Dan. You, you always feel like in cartoons, or you, it's a cartoon on this, so you, you always know you always want to, you always see a character in a show that you love or hate or some, a character that's annoying, you just really want to punch him in the face. So we're just going to watch this guy's video. Watch Dan's video on punching characters in the face and the tier list about it. And let's get into it. You ever just want to just punch a fictional character in the face? Yeah. I do. I actually think about this very often. So I've compiled a list of cartoon characters and I've ranked them based on how badly I want to punch them in the face. Let's begin. Oh, and just to clarify, oh, blues, F blues tier need to be like A or S. And S tier means I, I dislike. Punch them in the face. I don't I hate blue. Especially in the first episode, but when you chocolate. get to like chocolate. more of the episodes, it keeps start getting fucking annoying. Who doesn't love chocolate? I love chocolate, so I can relate. And, so I, and I, I am streaming this on Streamlabs. This little schmuck is yes. always causing a ruckus, pissing me off, dude. Always causing so many problems from everybody in the show. Yo. I gotta give him an A. I yes, like he needs to be out there. Boo is not ass like you really want to punch him in the face, but he's up. He's getting up there. He's like a. But he is kind of cute. But that's the only thing saving him from that. Essay. Yeah, in wow. that first episode is saving him. The first episode we introduced to Blue, Blue and the Machinery friends. But the rest of the show, he, he's he just want to punch him in the face. A belcher, man's has it hard enough without me punching him. In the yeah, face. Bob, I would give him like a C L. So F. Yeah. Franklin. I haven't seen Franklin. I ain't read the books and watch the shows in years, so I will, I will put Franklin like C. <laughs> it's on site, bro. It's on site. That's surprising. If I ever like see this S. motherfucker, it's on site. S. I hate him, bro. Look at his stupid face. Look at that stupid fucking face. You don't want to. You don't want to punch this mother sucker. How can you not want to punch him? Look at this. <laughs> he looks like a small little kid, even though he's supposed to be a kid anyway. Mark, bro, look how dumb he looks, and he's so boring. He's so. That's he, the... he is. His character is boring, even though I ain't seen the show, watched, read the books in years. I'll put like C because I ain't seen it for a long the time. Issue with him, he's so boring. I would imagine hanging out with him, bro. Ugh, I hate Franklin. Charlie Brown. Charlie Brown. Uh, I don't hate Charlie. Charlie's like C tier. He's such a schlemiel. I, I, I would feel bad if I punched him, yeah. but I have to admit, I kind of do want to punch him. I think I would punch him, but then I would feel extremely bad about it, so I'll give him a B. Popeye the Sailor Man. Um, yeah, I'm not, yeah, I'm not going to fight. I'm not going to punch him in the face because, like, you know how Popeye would punch is? No, I'll put him like L tier. I would not fight. Pop Popeyes. Trying to get punched into the ninth dimension. Yeah. So uh, F for sure. I would not mess with this guy. Same thing with Ed from. Yeah, I'm not gonna mess with Ed. Even though Ed have lost, have getting his ass whipped in the show, a couple of times, for some for somehow. But like Ed's supposed to be stronger than most of the kids, but he still gets his ass whipped. But like, I would not mess with Ed. But I will put Ed like C B C. Ed and Nettie, man. Punching this guy would be like throwing a penny at a brick wall. It yeah. would have absolutely no effect. F. Nigel Thornberry, the inspiration. I ain't of seen the Thorn the uh, Thornberry show in years. A lot of memes. This guy's kind of an OG, honestly. The only thing is he is a redhead, uh, and I don't like that. So I'm not gonna put him in the bottom Seven category. Show day. But I'm I still, still don't want to punch him that bad. Peter Griffin, man. Of. Uh, uh, I don't know, cause like in the show, he if people watch Family Guy, and y'all want me to do a reaction to Family Guy, I can. But like with Peter, I will put Peter like uh, maybe B, B, maybe B, because like he guys getting his ass whipped a lot too. Same thing with Brian. Brian is like A S. I would have said F tier in the first like eight seasons. But bro, Family Guy's been going on way too long. Yeah. He's, he's getting kind of annoying. It's getting kind of old. Yeah. Seth MacFarlane, please give up, B. Yeah. American Dad, on the other hand, has yeah, uh, actually gotten funnier as the show goes on. Like, the first... I would put American Dad, like, C Elf. You know, three, four seasons of American Dad weren't nothing special, but it just, it got funnier. 
So I'm gonna have to put him one tier lower than Peter. Yeah. Stan Smith, he's really funny in American. I, I like Stan. I like Steve. Um, if I had to guess, I would put Steve like B C. I don't really hate Steve like that. Bad, but let's be honest, we all know a kid like Stan Smith, and we all want to yeah. punch him in the face. Hey, this right here is a two for one. Johnny from Ed and Eddie and Ooh. Plank. Yeah, yeah, Johnny, yeah, Johnny and uh, Plank, Plank, Plank's the Chad, but Johnny is is annoying. Uh, we'll put up with Johnny, maybe a, maybe a or B. Also from Ed and Eddie, bro. If I see Plank, I'm going Cobra Kai on his ass, bro. I'm breaking boards over my head. Yeah. <laughs> God damn. Master of chopping chopping people's heads off. I would not mess with that guy. He would cut my head off like a fucking watermelon. I don't care. Also, Johnny, bro, I hate this mother sucker so bad. I hate I wanna squeeze his head like a pimple until it pops. S. Brian wow. Griffin. He's like one of those annoying atheists that gets mad at you when you tell him God bless you after he sneezes. I, I, I would put Brian like a, but the sh when the show kept going on, he kept getting annoying. He's right. He's up there. Brian's up there like S tier. I don't think I could be in a room with this guy for long. Enough. And Brian have lost a lot of fights, so and I could whoop yes. Brian's I'll ass even though he's a dog. Him. Just tell him you love him already. Stop being such a putz. Yeah. You idiot. A Squidward man. The it, older I get, the more I relate to him. Yeah. Cause he kind of do feel bad for school. Back in the day, you was like, he was like, you uh, well, no, you was annoyed with Squidward. But when you start getting older, you kind of feel bad for him. Cause like when you start getting older to like the age of more of an adult, you kind of like feel bad for Squidward. Cause you got like an annoying neighbor, like SpongeBob, that acts like a child. So I understand Squidward's behavior. So, I ain't seen a Hey Arnold in years too. The turtle from Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z, man. He's you don't even really see the turtle no more. I forgot his name. I put like the turtle like Elf because I don't because he's not annoying and you barely see him. He carried the show for me. I gotta be honest. I I, I wouldn't want to. Why would I punch a turtle, especially a giant sea turtle? That would be horrendous of me. F minions. Karen's favorite cartoon character. Uh, uh, the minions. Uh, I put the minions A. If I could get every single minion in existence... I don't hate the minions like a lot of people do. I don't know why. I just don't really hate them much. Line up in a row. But I get why people are annoyed with them. But I just... I, put, I will put them in A. And punch every I do want to punch a minion in the face. face. Straight line, I would do it. I don't care how long it takes. I would do it. S. <laughs> Me when I see Jake the dog, he's cute. I like Jake. I will put Jake like Elf. I like Jake. And he knows magic. And he's pretty cool. Yeah. So why why would I punch him? F. Peppa, what are you doing in my team? I haven't seen the show. I I never seen the show. I never seen Peppa. I never seen the show. Please get punched, mother sucker. S. Elmer Fudd. Uh, I I don't. Want I don't. Elmer. But, uh, I would put him C. I'm gonna put him in S tier because Bugs, like, fucks with this guy so much. Yeah. But at the same time, he's trying to kill him. So, what, what yeah. are we talking about? Also, is it just me or does something about Elmer Fudd seem racist to you guys? Like, I can't really put my finger on it. I can't really explain it. But he just, I don't know, he just seems racist. Wendy? Uh, he might be. Especially, he came around those times. He came around, like, the 19... I forgot when uh, Looney Tunes came out, like, so long ago, around the 60s, 50s, maybe a little bit, like, 70s, I don't really know. Listen, man, I don't want to punch a little girl. I really don't, but this chick's always messing around with Charlie Brown, yeah. bro, taking a finger off the football before he kicks it so he can fall. What a, what a bitch. Hey, DW, again. Yes, uh, yeah, put her up there, put her, like, in SNA, you know, everybody... Was annoyed with Dee Dee or her fuck what what the fuck her name is. I I don't want to punch a little girl, but I, I think you know there are some exceptions. Yeah, there are exceptions. Bro, what a D W. Yeah, bro. I just want to. I just want to. 
Right, but Arnold back. got his payback. S. Johnny Bravo, he used to be my hero as a uh, Johnny. John, even though he's both, he still he gets ass whipped by women too. So I'll put Johnny Bravo like B B A. Child, until the Me Too era happened, then I realized you know maybe he doesn't conduct himself in a very proper manner, but uh, he still has cool sunglasses. B. Yeah. Rolf, you must be crazy if you. Think yeah, I'm not gonna fight Rolf. Rolf is Rolf elf. Is the son of a shepherd. F. Scooby-Doo, a little... Uh, Scooby, uh, I'll put Scooby in like F. I don't want to punch Scooby. I like dogs. Fun fact about me, uh, a lot of the time growing up, Scooby-Doo was the only thing that was on, and I hated it. I thought it was the most boring show. I hated all the characters. Um, Scooby was like the best of them all, but I still didn't really like him either. But I, I grew up, I grew up with Scooby-Doo. I don't want to punch him that bad, so B. Scrappy, on the other hand, like, yeah, uh, put Scrappy like way up in S. Can we make a ultra S tier? I won't punch this little dog in the face. He's annoying, but I actually liked his show better than the original Scooby Doo show for some reason. So I, I don't know why I just hated Scrappy. I think it's not Scrappy. I just hate you know the live action movie. I hated Scrappy, but I like Scrappy when he was when Scooby Shaggy. Had their own little spinoff movie, spinoff show and movies where uh, they visit that ghost school. I grew up with that, mo grew up with that movie. I gotta put him one tier lower than Scooby. I know this is weird, but yeah, it is weird. Cut me some slack, all right? Roger from American Dad. I would not mess with Ro Roger. It's like C L. He is definitely the funniest character yeah, on the show. He, he is the funniest one in the show in uh, American Dad. Carries the show a lot of the time. But he's so annoying sometimes, man. It's just yeah. like, sometimes it just pisses... Like, imagine coming into contact with somebody that acts the way he acts. He's always, like, ruining shit for Stan. He's always causing issues. Yeah. He's always, you know, getting people addicted to crack and, like, being sexually weird. Well, he's an alien, so we... I get what they were doing with um, Roger, because he's an alien. People just don't know that he's a male or a, girl, a boy or a girl or a male or female. So they don't really know, so that's why he's like, always like, I can't really explain it. Like, uh, I gotta give him. A I just name. can't explain it. Like they always try to make him look like, be a guy, then be a girl, or it's just be like gay or lesbian or lesbian. It's just a part of his character because he's an alien, so you can't really tell what's uh. Let's just say Roger's like non-binary, even though I really don't like saying that. But let's just say he's that. Because like, I I, I don't know. I, I just wouldn't want to know this guy. Klaus, bro, he's such a schmuck. Yeah, I I want to punch Klaus, Klaus in the face like a like a. He's so, everybody on the. Show. But I will put Roger like B. Show hates him for good reason, but I don't I don't feel right about punching a fish. I'd still do it, so I give him a C. Okay. Blue from Blue's Clues. I love Blue's Clues. I love the, uh, Blue Dog. I put him in L. I didn't really have an issue with him. I think I think he's fine. You know, he's cute. Nothing wrong with him. F. Patrick Starr, man. Patrick. Oh, Patrick! I want to punch this motherfucker in the face. Put him as chop all his little uh, in, punch all his fucking. Antennas off, even though you don't have an antenna because you're not a fucking ant. But I want to stump him like a fucking ant. The duality of man. I've said this in previous. I used to like Patrick till he stopped becoming fucking annoying. Videos. I mean, I know he's a starfish, but he encompasses the duality of man because he can be SpongeBob's best friend. Yeah. Or his absolute nightmare. Yeah. And for that reason, I gotta give him a B. Ron I suppose you gave him a B. I gave him an S. He's a simp. Plain and simple, he's a simp. Uh, I don't know. I ain't seen Kim Possible in years. I ain't seen, yeah, I ain't seen this show in years. So I may put Ron and I put Ron and B like Patrick. Patrick, I would put Patrick and A. Put Ron like B. Hey, SpongeBob. Even if I wanted to punch Punch B SpongeBob, could, I would not fight SpongeBob because we've seen an episode where SpongeBob. Kept getting punched in the face, but couldn't feel it because he made out a sponge. I put a sponge for like C.L. Sponge Bob in the face, which I don't. He doesn't feel pain. Yeah. In fact, 
strikes to the face simply tickle him. So what would even be the yeah. point of punching him? F. Krusty the Clown, uh, I'm not a big Simpsons fan. I, I, me either. I haven't really fully watched Simpsons. I, love, I like the movie, even though it wasn't the biggest hit movie, but I liked it. And also, I hated him. I think that's the only time I've seen Simpsons is... I seen the black hole episode, but it was, uh, when they did that black hole episode, then I seen the movies, but I really didn't watch the no, and I watched like the very first episode of Simpsons when they did because the first episode was a Christmas episode. I think he was like my least favorite character. I think that's kind of the point. He's supposed to be a scumbag. Yeah. But yeah, I would very much like to punch him in the face. As Carl Weezer, I said it once. I'll say it again. Uh. I don't really know about Carl. I put Carl. Carl was like Steve that you want to punch him in the face. <clears throat> so I put Steve. I put like Carl like B at B A. We got two things in common. We love llamas and Jimmy's mom. So why would I want to punch this man in the face? He's like a kindred spirit. F. Man dark. Uh, I want to punch him just because of his laugh. <laughs> He, he, he's one of those annoying kids, so I will punch him in the face, too. S. Mojo Jojo. Why, why is he always trying to fight little girls, bro? Why is he always trying to fight little girls? I know I've, you know, said in this mm. tier list multiple times that I want to punch little girls, but... But tell him good the girl. It's him good the power girl is went after him first, so... But he's a villain, so it makes sense. I put I will put Mojo, like, S.A., because he's a villain. Don't say so you want that. to punch him in the face. The kid from... Oh my god, what a schlemiel. Look at this kid, bro. I ain't seen up in years, but he was kind of annoying. But you do, I do want to like punch him in the face. I put him like B.A. I don't know a kid that was like this, bro, back in school. But like, I would just feel terrible if I Fucking punched him Boy face, Scout. But I kind of want to, you know? So I, I give him a shit. Saudi Number Ho. two from Codename Kids Next Door. Something uh, doesn't sit right. I don't I, like him. I think he's a schmuck, alright? I like, I like number two. I like number two. Hey, I don't need to explain myself, but I do like number I put, I will put him like BC. The, she is very annoying to Dexter, yeah. but I feel like if you're not Dexter, she wouldn't be that bad. You know, so I give her a B. Oscar, I, I don't, uh, maybe. Oscar Proud. Dude, can we just admit this guy was a terrible father? Alright, he was a terrible provider. His snacks sucked. Yeah, he was a terrible provider, but he was good. He was a he was a good father, but he was not good at uh he was a terrible provider. He couldn't he tried to sell these how he got I always ask this question cuz like I get it, it was a kid show, but it has to be answered is that how he owns these plate owns like a warehouse and can make all this stuff even though he does even in all the stuff he does is fail all the time. How he's making money to get all this type of crap. It makes no sense. But he's getting, he got all this warehouse. Then he got a monkey as an assistant. I don't read. I don't. I just never get it. How he just. How he's not making money. But he got all this. He got facility every day making. Proud snacks. It's, it's just weird. It just doesn't make sense. Like, bro, just get a regular job. Just get a regular job, bro. You, you, you know, you guys were late on the bills all the time because you were trying to make these freaking snacks nobody liked, bro. Yeah. Just go get a 9 to 5. He's a good father, but he can be annoying sometimes. I'll, I'll put Oscar like A. There's nothing wrong with working a 9 to 5. Seriously, like, come on, bro. A, Kevin from Ed and Nettie. Yeah, I won't push Kevin like in fucking face. I'll put Kevin like A. Such a cocky little bastard. Kid was a bully. He deserves yeah. a taste of his own medicine. Therefore, if I ever see Kevin, bro, I'm knocking his freaking lights out, dog. Kevin goes in the S tier. He's absolutely 100% likely to get punched. Bugs Bunny, he's very powerful, dude. He yeah. Ain't no magic on it. Yeah, uh, I will not punch Bugs in the face. I actually like Bugs Bunny. Uh, I put Bugs like C Elf, almost like SpongeBob now. Uh, you don't want to get on his bad side because you know what happens to people that get on his bad side. Yeah. Like Elmer Fudd, for example. But I think as long as you don't make an enemy out of him, I think he's cool, bro. Like, I, I don't... 
really particularly want to punch him, so I give him an F. Hash catch him. Uh, he has too much energy for me, dude. I they I think they finally in Ash as a main character now. Even though it took us almost to the since the nineties for Ash to finally break out this character. In Yu-Gi-Oh, we are already like in a six, eight, six, maybe seven, eight season now. I think they just finished seven. And now we're going to the eight one now. I don't really know. And I stopped watching Yu-Gi-Oh or Deck Around Sexel, but I still like Yu-Gi-Oh. I hate people who have too much energy. It's like, you know, it's Friday. I night. do like Ash as character, but it been he been a child for so long and everything. But I will put Ash like B A, maybe B A B C. I don't know. I put him like says B says like, there. To go to the club, and then he somehow convinces me to go to the club. And then we're at the club. We're catching Pokemon at the club. We're battling gym leaders at the club, and it's like, ah, oh, should just stayed home, bro. How do you? How do you? I'm not the biggest fan of Pokemon, but I did grow up with Pokemon too. I just watched a lot more Yu-Gi-Oh than Pokemon. It me every time to do this, uh, so I give him a, I give him an A. Curious hmm. George. Uh, I like I Curious like George. Him, Even though I ain't seen it in years. Right I put Curious George like C. Do I, do I really have to give a reason? I just want to make sure that so the... Just when I look at Curious rec- George, that, rage my record, up inside of me, as, actually recording, I mean, so that's why monkey, I make sure. I don't know if I'd feel right punching a monkey. This is hard, bro. I, I'll put him in B, bro. I'll put him next to Mojo Jojo over here. Tina Belcher, bro, she's such a schlemiel. She's so pathetic. I feel bad for punching him in the face. But she has glasses, too, you know? I like Tina. Maybe, uh, maybe the top five best characters in the show. I guess she got a sex, sexuality type thing with a lot of pe- with a lot of boys. But I actually like her character because she done had good episodes and that did have some bad episodes. I put Tina like B. So, but she is annoying. As well, yeah. so I can't put her in F. I put, I put her like at Morky least B. The pig, uh, there's nothing particularly wrong with him. Sometimes he's annoying, so I'll give him a C. Daffy Duck, bro, he's so annoying. He's he's always like. If people remember that t- TV show Duck Darshers? Oh god, I grew up with that. So hard. I used to go. I used to uh, live with my grandmother, and we always go to her room, and she always put on Duck Darshers. Duck, yeah, Duck. The Dodgers, uh, when, uh, D- uh, Daffy Duck, yeah, Daffy Duck, uh, go to space with, uh, with him. Like it, it was a good show. To start arguments with people, bro. Like, why are you arguing with me? But he, the, I will put him, like, A, because he wants to, he wants to fight people, so I'll put him, like, A. We're in the middle of a field, bro. Like, stop, you know, just A, stop. B. He's so annoying, dude. I don't, I don't like him. I don't like Daffy Duck. Daffy Duck. I think I'm pronouncing his name. I gotta put him in A. Donkey, he's cute and he's funny. I like Donkey. He can be annoying, too. I put Donkey like BC. In the Shrek movies, but I feel like hanging out with him would be annoying, you know? I've said this. I've said this in other videos. I feel like he'd be annoying, bro. So, let's give him a B. The dog from Up. I love Up. I think it's one of the best Disney movies. I think it's one of the best animated movies. Uh, at the same time, if my dogs could talk, I think they would be very... Yeah, annoying. he's... That dog, I, I like up too, but the dog was annoying, almost like the kid, so I will put him like B. Annoying, so I'll just put him in B. Lord Farquaad, yo! Uh, get get this man like A, S, like S, S, A. Get, the, get this motherfucker... Up there, Lord Farquaad, like he's out to fuck somebody, like he's trying to do with Fiona, but he came and do that, so he had to masturbate and made the uh fucking mirror look at it like fucking creepo. Fuck this guy, man. <laughs> he's such a putz, bro. He's such a hater, and he like yeah, he was he trying to kill Fiona, and I'm like, get out of here. Also, like, he has little man syndrome. He's yeah, just a perfect like. Uh, mixture of toxic traits that I hate in a human being so I give him an ass bro. Yeah. I knock his fucking block off if I ever see him Gary from Spongebob I mean I can't really I, I don't have a problem with Gary I put Gary like elf 
think of a reason that I would want to punch a snail. I mean, he's, he's essentially a cat. He's essentially a house cat, so I see no, I see no issues with Gary. So I yeah. think I'm going to F. Sheen? Sheen from Jimmy Neutron? <sighs> uh, I hate, I, dis, I did not like his show. If y'all want me to uh, watch, like, Jimmy Neutron and Sheen and playing Sheen, but I had to watch Jimmy Neutron then playing Sheen. But if y'all want me to watch that, it's just, uh, it's just put it in the description below. Um, he was very annoying to me, dude. I, I kind of, like, he kind of, like... I, I like Sheen in the show. He's just a regular side character. Okay, he is playing as a side character, but when he was, had his own show, homie was annoying. I'll put, like, Sheen A because of that awful playing Sheen show. Oh, show to me sometimes, so I, I gotta give him a, I gotta give him an A. Yeah. Doug? I don't care about you, Doug. i never seen Doug. Doug. You're boring, bro. You're fucking boring. But is being boring enough of a reason to want to punch someone in the face? A little bit. I like Skeeter better than you, Doug. I'm putting Skeeter lower than you, bro, because you're so boring. At least Skeeter wasn't boring. Wait, was that his name, Skeeter? The, the bad guy? No, wait. Skeeter was his friend. What, what's the bad guy's name? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I've never seen Doug. Fry? I mean, we all liked him on Futurama, yeah. but let's be honest. And now they should like, revive Futurama. Just keep the show dead. Why y'all should I bring back dead franchises and dead shows and making it worse? Keep Futurama dead, but no, they're going to milk uh, Futurama. I hope if they revive it, they actually make it good instead of making it bad. One of those guys who never applies himself. He's just like a schmuck and never puts any effort. I put Fry like a B, maybe around B A. Into anything, he just wants to sit around all day, you know, eating eating uh, dog food made for humans because that's a thing they have in the future. But I don't know, man. Because Fry is from the past, went to the future because like. I think I remember Fry was a pizza guy. He was going through because the dude had a horrible life. Then he went to a pod because uh, he w he slipped through the pod. He was frozen there for like maybe what five thousand years or a thousand years. I don't really remember. It's been so long since I seen Futurama. I give him a B. I don't know. Chris Griffin. He. Chris Griffin. Yeah, he's annoying sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, he has an annoying voice. Yeah, he's a loser. But, I mean, I think we can relate to him a bit. Yeah. So, I'm not going to put him very high, so I'll give him a B. Yeah, I was a bone next to... A bone near Peter. Stan from South Park? Uh... I don't care. I, if I had the others... If I had the others, I'd put Stan like B. Stan had good episodes, then had some bad episodes. Stan was arrogant little shit, too. Much for him, I mean doesn't have any qualities that make me hate or love him. I'm not really a big fan of South Park, and a lot of people give me shit for this. I don't, I don't blame you for not liking South Park. I get the reason why a lot of people do not like South Park. I like South Park, but I get... I understand why people dislike South Park. I understand. Um, I don't think it's a genius show, as other people say. It's but, I mean, I, I don't know. It's not the best show ever, but I, I like the show. Bart Simpson, uh, he's cool, kind of. Bart, Bart was annoying. I, like I said, I haven't seen Simpson in a while, but Bart was an Eric, almost like Stan, but different, like a, but he's like a piece, piece of shit to his dad, so I'll put him like A, but instead of one punch him to the time, face. He's kind of a schmuck, and he's always causing issues, he's always getting in trouble. You know, I hated kids like Bart when I was in school. Yeah. I never wanted to be like Bart. You know what? I want to punch Bart. Yeah. I want to punch him. That's what I would say. I would just punch him. What's this guy's name? Bro? Benson. Benson of Benson has some really good episodes. Uh, I'll put Benson like. I put Benson like like C. I'll put Benson like C. He do go through so much. I understand why Benson. Had to with more more guy Rippy. It were episodes where he took it too far and has did have bad episodes too, but it's not wasn't that many. He's just he was that guy. He he was a boss that was annoyed because people didn't work that was slacking off, 
Listen, I work at Walmart. I understand. Can we use? Because I, I work in the parking lot. We do. We did have people that were slacking off too. I was cool with them, but I understand why boss like people who work. Yo, know, their boss do be annoyed with people that do, do not work. I understand? Benson's like um, C to me. What's his name? What is the name of the boss from regular show? Benson, that's his name. All right. Well, I hate this mother sucker because he's a he's just such a typical boss, you know. But then again, he does cut Mordecai and Rigby a lot of slack. Yeah. Sometimes, but he is kind of a hard ass. I don't know, bro. Uh, I give him an A. Donald Duck, he's definitely less of a schmuck than Daffy, but he's still pretty annoying. Yeah. Uh, I, I always wonder, the people who, I always wonder, I, I think I may put like a poll, who's your favorite, Donald Duck or Daffy Duck? Who's your favorite, either the other two? But he's not like, you know, extremely terrible, so I give him a B. Lightning McQueen? We already know about the relationship Lightning McQueen had with Donald Trump. Google it. But, uh, I mean, I don't... He's a car. Why would I punch him? Yeah. He, he's made of metal, so it makes sense. You put him like elf. Car. It's kind of weird. Um, but if he wasn't a car, I would put him like fucking B. Nothing wrong with him. I'll give him my F. Mordecai, I mean, he's cool, bro. He's yeah. relatable. He, Mordecai has some bad episodes, and he was a simp, too. I put him, if he gonna put him right there, I'll put more guy right there. I'll put more guy like, hey, I just want to punch more guy in the face for being a simp. Uh, he's funny? Nothing wrong with him, bro. Uh, why would I want to punch him? Why would I want to punch more guy? He's I fun. would. And then there's Didi again. Oh, you um, got Didi, why Didi twice in here? I don't know why she's in there twice, but. Yeah. Well, I think that's it, man. This is probably the longest one I've done so far. And I hope y'all enjoyed the video and go subscribe to Dan. Cause I never seen all his videos. This is the one I found. Oh, he made twenty five more of these, so I may watch the others, but watch the others later. But I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Like and subscribe to the channel and his too. And I will see you guys later. And goodbye.